everyone, it's Aaron from Rudy Visuals and in today's video we're reviewing something a little bit different today but something that could still be fantastic for the right kind of video creator which is the Hollyland Solidcom C1. It's a full duplex wireless intercom headset system with a transmission range of up to a thousand feet which is about 304 meters. So this is a fully wireless intercom system meaning that the headsets themselves are self-contained and you don't need any additional cables or devices attached to them. And the great thing about this system is that you don't need a hub or a base station to use the headsets unlike with some other systems out there. And you know what else is great? Today's sponsor, Zyro. Zyro is an affordable website builder that provides easy access to creating professional looking websites without the need for any prior coding or web design knowledge. Using Zyro's drag and drop website builder, you can actually set up your website for your photography or filmmaking business in absolutely no time. So you can get yourself out there and start landing those big jobs and clients. Zyro provides access to powerful AI tools to help you at every step, starting with being able to generate your very own templates that meets all of your website needs, saving tons of time on adapting pre-existing templates. As freelance photographers and filmmakers ourselves, we know how important it is to be able to present your work just the way you want it to be. And you'll be happy to know that Zyro offers many different tools to present your photos and videos in your ideal layout. Best of all, Zyro features an AI writer to help you create high quality content for your website and can come in handy when writer's block kicks in. The AI writer will generate tons of examples which you can then modify to make your own. Zyro is an affordable option for newcomers and professionals whilst providing high quality service, 24 hour seven support and fast website loading speeds to give you and your potential clients the best possible experience. Use our offer code RudyVisuals and you can save up 71% on your photography portfolio using Zyro's limited time deal which provides you with a custom domain, three months free with any yearly plan. You can use our link in the description below or the pinned comment. So get started today, back to today's video. So why do you need this and who exactly is this for? So a system like the Solidcom C1 is incredibly useful for communication, especially when working on large projects where you need to coordinate between different crew members or different departments. So for example, it's great for working on large video productions like corporate events, films, music videos, etc., where you have to communicate with multiple shooters or collaborate with a large production team. Even for non-video creation, it's extremely useful for things like work events. In my day job, I work as a video producer now for university, and I've been able to use this for the past couple of weeks for some video and some events projects as well. And the headsets worked without any issues. So how much is it? Well, the price of the Solidcom C1 kind of depends on the number of headsets you want to get. So I'll put up all the price options right here. So we have the 4S, which comes with four headsets and costs just under about $1,000, which is about 900-ish pounds here in the UK. And that does seem very expensive at first glance for what is basically a glorified walkie-talkie set. But as you'll see from some of the competitors out there with similar kind of specs and range, the price is actually pretty reasonable. And of course, as you'll see in the review later on, there are a number of reasons for the price tag. First up, let's take a look at what's in the box. So the solid Com C1, does come in a pretty nice carry case which will keep all your gear protected as you'll probably be using these quite a lot on the go. And inside we have the four headsets each in individual compartments and each comes with its own protective carry bag. On the right you also get the charging dock with eight batteries so that you can always have a spare battery charging for every headset that you use. You also have a manual and some stickers and in the upper compartment you get four spare foam cushions for each headset and some spare microphone guards. You also get four of these nice over the ear cushions so that you have different options for different preferences. And finally, the DC power supply for the charging dock and a USB-A to USB-C cable. So moving on to the build quality, the actual headsets units themselves, they actually feel really, really premium and definitely feel like they're worth the price tag. Sort of hard to describe without you actually feeling them for yourself, but you definitely don't feel like, you know, they don't feel like your average Zoom or Skype headsets. The headsets are made with this PC ABS material and weighs about 168 grams each. And when wearing the headset, you know, you can definitely feel the weight, but it's not too noticeable or uncomfortable. Actually far from it, they're actually really, really comfortable and they fit really nicely and snugly. They don't feel, you know, indestructible, but there's definitely like a reassuring feel to them. They just look and feel like a premium product that justifies the heavy price tag. So overall, I think the headsets feel pretty solid and rugged and would probably survive long and harsh usage. 
Additionally, the ear cushions are really well padded and the headsets don't put too much pressure around your head. I also really like how they added another cushion on this side so it doesn't dig into the side of your head like some of other headsets I've seen. When wearing the Solicom C1 for longer periods of time, I didn't feel fatigued in any way. And some of my work events that I tested this out on went on for like a good four to five hours or so. And I didn't really feel that bad having them on that whole time. Likewise, the charging dock has the same nice build quality and is capable of charging those eight batteries at once. The dock has a light indicator for each battery with orange meaning that it's still charging and green indicating a fully charged battery. In terms of ease of use and features, in order to just run the system, all you need to be doing is using the master headset, which is the one with the red plate on the side. And this headset essentially plays the role of your base station and needs to be on for the other headsets to work. But what I really liked about the Solidcom C1 is just how hassle-free it is to use. The headsets automatically pair on when powered on, as long as you have the master headset on, so there's no time racing when setting them up. You just literally pop the headset on and you're ready to go. So let's take a closer look at the headsets. As far as I can see there's no real difference in terms of the design between the master headset and the remote headsets. The battery slot is on this side and there is a latch that opens the door where the battery slots in. And flipping over to the other side we have the on and off slider right here and for the controls we have a tactile plus and minus switches to control the volume, an A button that is used for pairing and the B button that works with the additional hub that you can purchase. The Mic Room also has an auto mute feature built in where it automatically mutes the sound when moved up into this position, which is nice and handy. There's also an indicator light on the mic so that you know whether the sound is being transmitted. A green light means that everything is working fine. However, if it starts flashing, then that means that the headset is not connected. If the headsets ever do fail to connect, all you have to do is hold down the A button on both headsets one of them being the master headset for five seconds and they should pair and you should hear an indication. According to HoloLens marketing materials for the Solicom C1, the headsets feature something called DECT, DECT, DECT 6.0 technology, which is supposed to prevent people from outside the system from hearing your conversation through encryption. Unfortunately, we're not able to test that in any kind of way, but it's good to know that your conversations are private and it's definitely good to know that the encryption is there. So it's something to take into consideration when purchasing the Solicom C1 and other headsets as well out there on the market. Now in terms of the sound quality and the sound clarity, Holyland advertises the Solicom C1 as having exceptional sound quality. From our testing, the headsets provide very, very decent audio. You know, the voice, the sound is always very clear. And because the headsets are equipped with directional microphones, they tend to minimize unwanted noise when someone is speaking. Unfortunately, I'm not able to capture audio directly from the headsets as there's no way of plugging them in, but I did stick one of these onto a microphone, which is the second best thing, I guess. So here's a quick sound test. So here's a quick sound test for you. I'm just having the microphone record the audio coming from the actual headset. And as you can hear, it sounds very decent. My voice should be very nice and clear. And that's pretty much all you're gonna be using this headset for is, and that the person on the other end can hear you clearly. Now, Holland claims that the Solicom C1 provides a reliable transmission range of up to a thousand feet, 304 meters or so. So we're gonna head over to the park and test if this claim stands. Okay, so we're now gonna do the distance test. So Veronica's got the master headset and I've got remote set one. So we're gonna try and walk a thousand feet apart from each other and hopefully we'll be able to hear each other clearly. Right now we're right next to each other and there's literally no delay whatsoever and I can hear you very clearly. Yep, same with me. All right, so it's like literally we're in the same room, <laughs> literally. So let's go, bye bye. So we're about 250 feet. You'll see Veronica right here, wave. And it's literally no lag, no drop in audio quality. I've not heard it drop a single, a single point at all. Right, so at this point I'd say we're about 500 feet. You'll see a tiny little dot there. I think that's you. Yeah, I'm trying to find you as well. <laughs> I think that is you. Uh, but somewhere. again, it's like we're pretty much on the phone. No drop in quality. You sound crystal clear. The connection hasn't dropped at all. Okay, so according to my app, we're about 750 feet apart. You'll see a tiny little white dot there. And again, no drop in quality, no drop in signal. Could you just say a sentence, anything? And uh, yeah, no, like I can see you perfectly yeah, as well. Yeah, it's perfectly fine. So we pretty much can't, I can't even see you anymore. You've gone past the trees yeah, over I'm there. I'm like under the tree. Um, so we're about around 1,000 feet now. Should we just keep going? Yeah, it... let's keep going until it actually cuts out. So we are past 1,000 feet at this point. It hasn't really, again, no drop in connection. 
But right now I can hear that it's actually been uh, it cut out a little bit. Oh, it's. I can still hear you. Yeah, but we're it's like at a little bit choppy. So we're past a thousand feet, and it is starting to just break up in little bits now. I can hear. So as you saw, even at a thousand feet, we're still able to communicate very clearly between us. And bear in mind that we were on an open field, so there was nothing kind of obstructing the view. I wasn't able to film this, but I actually used these in some work events as well, where we did have kind of bigger crowds and we did work on like multiple different floors. I don't think I ever strayed over a thousand feet then, but I was always able to have a strong connection to my team members and the audio never dropped and the sound quality was very clear. So big thumbs up there. Moving on to the battery life. So the battery life on the headsets varies with the master headset lasting about five hours and the remote headsets lasting about 10 hours. So we've never had any issues with the battery life on these and having the extra batteries means that you will never run out of juice as the batteries take about two and a half hours to fully recharge. So as I said before, you basically have like unlimited battery life as you swap them out. So in summary, the HoloLens SolidComp C1 is a very reliable and premium wireless intercom system. And while it's probably not gonna be useful for your average YouTuber or solo content creator, I actually would highly recommend it for small to mid-sized production teams, content creators who work events or like socially distant working scenarios like film crews, etc. I know the elephant in the room is why not just use you know, your smartphone for communication. But I have worked on big video crews before and the convenience of just having a dedicated device for wireless communication means you can just concentrate on, you know, what you're doing and not faffing about with pairing Bluetooth headsets and getting people's numbers or accounts or setting up using WhatsApp or Zoom or groups, etc. So I definitely see the appeal of the Solidcom C1. You know, as niche as the target audience might be, for those of you who do need something like this, absolutely brilliant. With these headsets, you definitely get what you pay for. They feel very premium and having those extra batteries means you'll, again, never have to really worry about running out of power and they will 100% help your team communicate and run your video or work projects more efficiently. So yeah, big recommendation. Anyway, guys, that's gonna do it for this review. Let us know what you thought down there in the comment section below. A big thank you once again to Solidcom and also to Zyra for sponsoring this video. If you've got any questions, leave them down there in the comment section below and hit that like button if you found this video useful. Subscribe to see more. You can also follow us on socials. And again, as always, I will see you on the next video. Peace.